Hello and welcome to this video tutorial from ComputerGarGar.com. In this video, we are going to look at how we can display these task bars of our Gantt chart behind the non-working time. So it's quite a common question on my MS Project course is this, because if people are new to Gantt charts or new to MS Project, although we know that this grey bars indicate that time, you know, effort is not happening, work is not happening. It can be argued that because the bars go over them or through them, it's kind of misleading and giving the impression that work is happening at time, which it's not. So, we could right mouse click anywhere in this kind of background of the chart area, choose non working time. And we can choose the setting to display in front of the bars, which will then kind of break the bars up if I click OK here and kind of clearly indicate that work is not happening during those periods. And that is arguably a better uh, representation than previous. However, we could quite easily change that back if we change our minds. Now we may have noticed as a kind of bonus for this video that if I go back into my non-working time settings we also had the ability there to change its colour. It's also not uncommon on my courses that people ask me this of the creating element of branding on our project plans or our programmes or also because some people believe that, that grey non-working time um, it's sometimes hard to see because it's so faint, depending on the resolution and your lighting, etc., um, of what you may be displaying this on, it may not be that clear. So I could, for example, choose a light to green and click OK. I can quite easily change the colouring of how non-working time is presented. I hope you found this video useful. Please check out some of our other video tutorials on our YouTube channel or check us out at computergarga.com.